There are plans to transform an eyesore in Wayne County. This building used to be a very busy Sears store. It has been empty now for years. And now a developer is taking over the property on Southfield Road near I-75 in Lincoln Park. Megan Woods is live in Lincoln Park. And Megan, what are the plans? Well, the plans are still in the works, but right now it looks like a hotel and retail shops. Now, when we spoke to people who live nearby, they say driving by this sign, this property, and remembering the bustling shops here, including Farmer Jack, all those uh, stores were torn down. But now there's a new sign that says new retail development and has people excited for change. It's, it's kind of like a big, giant eyesore. For many living nearby, it's hard to look at this vacant 270,000 square foot former Sears when they remember the bustling shopping center that used to be here. Oh yes, <laughs> shop there myself. <laughs> it was just disappointing to see it just slide downhill. The shops all closed down, the smaller ones, and then the, then the restaurants left, and then last one's out Sears. Well, the new owner wants to start fresh. Last month, a 27 page plan was submitted to Lincoln Park's Brownfield Redevelopment Authority. In the document, details of a project where the former Sears will be demolished and the construction of seven commercial buildings with parking and a four story hotel. Nothing is set in stone, but it does have people talking. I don't know if we need another hotel. I'd rather see commercial stuff and, and things for the kids to do. I'd like to see something that everyone can just go to. But they also aren't ready for another disappointment. Like the rumor of there being a, a movie studio up there for the longest time when that was talked about. It had been nice, but it just, just fizzled out. I want to see something there that doesn't fizzle out. Other people we spoke to say they were hoping this would be turned into a Costco's, but nothing is set in stone quite yet. A city council has uh, scheduled a public hearing so people in the community can speak up, share their thoughts, but also learn about these plans. That's April 17th, live in Lincoln Park. I'm Megan Woods, Local 4. Okay, we'll keep, continue to keep an eye on it. Megan, thank you.